What's up, everybody? Hey, Fight Dialog family. Aldrich Gorney here. Come back to you again with another interview. This time I have PFL women's lightweight contender, Miss Olena. Hello. How, how you doing? I'm doing great. That's Just finished training. That's good. Thank you for your time and coming on the show. And hello to the fans over in the Ukraine as well, too. How you guys doing? <laughs> well, um, this is the second half of the season in the PFL bubble. Obviously, you know, you, um, you're in a... the you're coming off a loss, and you're uh, facing your next opponent, Larissa Pacheco, who made it to the finals. Talk to me about that matchup stylistically. Uh, honestly, um, like, um, we all, I'm not sure about all, but I can speak only about myself. Mm -hmm. Like, it's take a long time to know who's my opponent. Like, preparation is going, going. First of all, we cannot come back home. We need to stay in U.S. It was like a rule when I come here. Like, my plan was come back home, but then, like, I have no choice. I need to come back. I need to stay here. So, and I choose uh, Las Vegas and prepare there. But uh, I'm waiting, like, every week. One week past two, three, four, five, and still no opponent. And then they told me, like, your next opponent is Larissa. So... Who else, if not me, you know? Who have enough balls to fight with Larissa, if not me? So I accept this challenge. That's good. And, uh, of course, you know, everyone has to score points to solidify to get in the playoffs. Of course, a lot of people are not safe, even people with higher bank. So talk to me about, like, having that that drive to, like, I have to get a finish to solidify my spot. Honestly, let's be honest, like, uh, I don't give a fuck about points. <laughs> like, I didn't fight, uh, haven't fight three years. I'm so excited to be here, and I'm so s excited that I can fight one more fight, you know, and you never know what happened with other girls with the huge points in the future, you know? Yeah. Like, <laughs> I'm not wish them anything, <laughs> but still, <laughs> I will be ready, you know? Mm -hmm. <laughs> So, I mean, uh, like, points is good, but uh, I'm thinking only about the fight. I just want to make a good fight, good show, just uh, I'm thank God and thank especially Ray Sefo to invite me to this tournament. And I just try to show my best in the next fight. If God give me opportunity to finish it or just win it by points, it's okay or like I don't give a fuck I just want to make a show I'm excited just fighting you know mm -hmm. it's fun for me it's it's my like uh, job of my dreams <laughs> I don't want to do anything else except fighting I want to fight 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 as much as possible and so how I don't I don't care how many fights PFL give me in this year but I will be happy as much as they can and I never say no to open and will be Larissa or Kyla or Clarissa Shields. I don't care, like, okay, they have names. Yeah, they're good girls, but girls, you don't know how I grew up. You don't know my motivation to fight. <laughs> so whatever they give me, okay, I accept the fight. But I hope that uh, mm -hmm. I prepare next time at home, honestly. <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you for that insight. You know, a lot of people, uh, you know, talk about the enjoyment of fighting. I've been fighting uh, for a very long time. I read that uh, you uh, you're a champion in uh, karate and also Muay Thai, correct? Oh, I fight in like uh, 14 or 15 years already. Like I'm national champion of boxing, uh, national champion of Muay Thai, uh, World Cup champion kickboxing. I fight in long, long time. <laughs> yeah, but it was everything in amateur, and I became pro MMA fighter so quick. Because uh, in my country, we don't have amateur MMA. We just start to make it have it now. But mm -hmm. in 2016, we don't have an opportunity to try it before you go to <laughs> pro. So, <laughs> like, okay, you want to fight in MMA? You go to pro and you go to China. No problem. Fly. <laughs> so, and I go to China. This is, like, my uh, first fights away in China. So, it's everything challenge. And it's a challenge, first of all, with myself. Mm -hmm. You know, I challenge with myself. So... Uh, who will be? Can I ask? Yeah, thank you, thank you so much. Uh, yeah, the yeah, top of the bottom. First, first, first. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so uh, it's no matter, like, mm. actually, who will be. I'm just happy to be here. Thank God for this. Because I know a lot of fighters not fly here because they don't have a visa. Mm -hmm. So, and they sit without any kind of job. They cannot make their job. They became, like, um, 
uh, coaches, they became like a bodyguard, but I'm just happy that I have opportunity to do uh, what I like to do, fight. And that's amazing. I see that it brings the enjoyment out of you, uh, and that's that's tremendous. Uh, and you have a very bright sense of humor and charismatic uh, personality. Thank so, you. <laughs> you know, it's just it's just a joy. I, I feel it. So I, I I like this. Are you are you like this? Um, are you like this? Uh, you have a switch when you turn it on to fighting, or you just like you're just this calm leading up to fight week. Oh, uh, when I go to fight, I think like uh, you know Billy Milligan. <laughs> yeah, he, he has a lot of faces. Mm -hmm. So yeah, um, I'm changing when in fight. Mm -hmm. In fight, you became rude, you became mean, but still try to control control your emotions. In regular life, I'm like I'm boring person. Honestly, I'm calm. Mm -hmm. I try not to move too much. <laughs> like you know what funny? Like uh, when uh, we have a vacation. Sometimes with my friends, I have opportunity to. S it's not often because usually I prepare for something or I need to be always in shape. Mm -hmm. But sometimes, like people say, "Oh, why don't like you active, like active rest?" Come on, bro. <laughs> active. <laughs> 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 I have active life. I just want to see it, watch TV or some movie. Bring me food. I will be the happiest <laughs> person <laughs> ever. You know. I don't like to too much movement, but uh, sometimes mm, I like to travel. I like to see new places, and when I was in uh, uh, Las Vegas, I like I rent the car, mm -hmm. and I show okay, what can I see? I'm not a good fan of gambling, mm -hmm. so and I don't have enough money for gambling. Let's be honest. <laughs> 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 yeah. So and I see okay, what do you have here? Like okay, uh, it's like um, mm, I forget the name, like it uh, like a protection from the river. Uh, Goover, Goover, Hoover. They have like Hoover Dam. Yeah. Mm. Okay. I need to go there next Saturday af after running. Okay. I go there. Okay. Next Saturday, what I going to do? I go to Grand Canyon, but it's five hours. I don't give a fuck. I go there. I want to <laughs> see this. You know. Yeah. Maybe I die tomorrow. You never know when you die. It's true. <laughs> yeah. So, and it's just rent. And you know what? Funny. When I fly to Vegas, and um, I have driver license, mm -hmm. but I'm really horrible driver. <laughs> horrible. <laughs> like what to do <laughs> because <laughs> I, I i took my driver license like 13 years ago so long long time ago mm -hmm. and after i took it i never drive anymore i oh. don't have i'm travel a lot i prepare i live in other countries so and in las vegas you have no opportunity you must have a car mm -hmm. because you cannot just walk yeah y yeah so and like for one week I learned how to drive, you know, mm -hmm. and <laughs> this was so <laughs> funny. Like before I judge my dad, like, dad, why are you so rude with other drivers? Because he opened the window, you know, in Korean style. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> dad, no, they can know me. No, please, please. You know, and, and then like I feel it when some person not turn light. Mm -hmm. What the fuck? Why? I turn light. You <laughs> I open my window. What the and then, you know, I start to speak Russian with them. <laughs> I, then, I, oh my God, they don't understand what they say. But still, you know, like, why I did it? They didn't do. And my friend who helped me to learn how to drive, he said, please, please be calm. I am calm. Why <laughs> they don't turn like, you see, we can die with you, you know. <laughs> it was fun. Yeah. Uh, what's the name? Yeah, how you describe that, you know, yelling. Thing. That's how they drive in New York, too. Oh, it that's why I like New York. <laughs> 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 that's why I like New York. After my, uh, after this is, you know, mm, people like, not all, but uh, people like to judge no, other people. Mm -hmm. And uh, I, I don't like it. I'm not judge. Whatever you make, it's your business. It's not my business. Yeah. I'm not got to mm -hmm. be judge someone. Mm -hmm. So when I lost my fight, Mm. Uh, of course I'm upset. I mean, first fight in PFL, mm -hmm. like uh, I'm not fight so many years and I have a opportunity and I can win this fight, but I didn't, I lost by points. Anyway, and I think, okay, Helen, Olena, you have uh, two ways. You can cry all these days and waiting for your flight, or you can just take your clothes and go to New York because it's three hours from us. So guess what I did? I go to New, New York. York for two days <laughs> and I see everything as I can to see in New York. Mm -hmm. It was amazing. So I like New York. And this is the type of my city. Like a lot of people mm -hmm. like I feel my. Uh, of course, it was a little bit dangerous, especially um, 
like uh, at night. <laughs> 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 so I feel a little bit like, okay, Helen, you need to come back to hotel. It's dangerous. Go alone. Come mm. on. Yeah. So, uh, you talked about food earlier uh. and everything <laughs> like that. Um, and you talked about chicken. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Your favorite food, chicken. Y yeah, uh, I'm a huge fan of chicken. Mm -hmm. Like, uh, and I'm a huge fan of all kind of meat. Like, vegetarian story, not about me, you know? Mm -hmm. Like, I need meat, and uh, I like hunting. Like, I shoot since my childhood with my father, you know? So, mm -hmm. like, I'm hunter in all my life, in everything, in, in my job. <laughs> <laughs> And I like food, especially the meat. Chicken, yeah. I'm dreaming about when we make weight, I go uh, and buy some chicken to me. Mm -hmm. But now, like most of this time, I need to eat boiled chicken. <laughs> but after weight cuts, I hope my nutritionist high. <laughs> <laughs> just a little bit. You know, everything <laughs> starts from just a little bit. Nothing can happen. Mm -hmm. Always happen. <laughs> Always. <laughs> it's, it's just, you know, when you make weight, like, it just just a little bit and nothing happens nobody uh, nothing happens nobody knows everybody knows <laughs> because mm -hmm. <laughs> you start from one piece another one like chocolate uh, cake uh, fried chicken french fries and then you cannot stop anymore <laughs> 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 and then you know uh, once you wake up and s look at yourself and like what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> what happened with this body? <laughs> Why I cannot move? <laughs> yeah, so I need to control myself. But I'm a huge fan of um, chicken. I'm a huge fan of all uh, steaks. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like fried ribs. Oh my God. Oh my God. Uh, so, 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 <laughs> I can sorry. speak about so, it a lot. So, uh, I think we're making her hungry, making everybody hungry right now. You know, um, before I let you go. Of course, everyone loves music. You know, when I first met you, you uh, have a, a infamous Tupac book bag. You told me you're a big fan. Uh, it's the first day. First day. The <laughs> yeah. first day I met you, say, <laughs> I was like, wow. wow. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, yeah, like. Uh, I'm a huge fan of Tupac, of Notorious, of Coolio, you oh. know. Yeah, I know. G Gangsta's <laughs> Paradise? <laughs> Definitely. I had that on my playlist, too. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely, you know. Like, people think that if you are from Europe, you didn't know the like uh, rap mm. culture, but yeah. if you're a huge fan of good music, you will know the best one. Mm. For nowadays, like I'm not like give you some example who I listen. I don't like, for example, Weekend mm -hmm. or some like uh, popular music for everyone, like Billie Eilish. I don't want to hurt anybody's feelings, yeah. but it's not make me like a drive because. They don't know what they like, what they see about life. Everybody <laughs> curtail. Like, Come on, girl. You know, <laughs> I, I, I'm from country where you need to survive. Mm. And these guys like Kule, Tupac, they sing it exactly what I know. You know, mm -hmm. you need to learn how to survive. Yeah. You know, so I'm a huge fan of good music and I like rock. I like and again, old rock like ACDC, Kiss. Mm you know gangs of roses oh yeah yeah this mm. is what type of music i listen in but sometimes i wake up i can start listening vivaldi chopin tchaikovsky classic music so mm. it depends from my mood but most of all of course i listen like uh, rap music like i like it and yeah when i see your like uh, when i see your bag and i say oh tupac and then i say oh hi <laughs> see, this, this is the famous bag by the way guys yeah, this yeah, is the yeah, bag yeah, yeah. this is the bag by the way so yeah that's that's the famous bag she tells me about so uh, because even um I don't, um I don't know if you s uh, saw his interview even when he was so young mm -hmm. like he's he was so smart person yeah. you know he know exactly what he talking about mm -hmm. even about like one of interview he, sp he spoke about uh white house uh, white house mm -hmm. yeah like in in uh, Washington DC I don't know yes yeah so and he said like how can you say about poor people you have so many room there and you not even propose mm. these po poor people on the street like some some place you live in Lon, you president and you speak you don't know what you're talking about you know yeah just help somebody not pretend and this is like my philosophy mm, I don't like to pretend I am as I am mm -hmm. you know uh, that's why uh, a little bit uh, hard for me mm, here like uh, 
first time when I first time was in US, like mm. people here tried to be nice and they just ask, how are you? And it's like a type of intelligent, you know? Mm -hmm. In my country, if I ask, how are you? I definitely need to know how are you, what happened in your <laughs> life? <laughs> <laughs> you yeah. got, bro, you have problem, we solve it. You know, we solve it. <laughs> I totally get it. Yeah, mm. so uh, this is like, uh, that's why I like maybe, I feel something common in this, in his songs, you know, because like real songs. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Yeah. Well, thank you. Um, well, thank you for your time. I really appreciate it. And guys, make sure you tune in this Friday uh, to watch Elena take on Larissa Pacheco at PFL 6. You know, make sure you watch it. Tune in. Who doesn't love violence? I love violence. You love violence. It's beautiful violence. God damn it. All right. See you guys soon. Thank you, TFD family.